Hello YouTube. Well, today's the day. I'm doing the grand unveiling of my WD-45. I'll call this the last, the last video in this series of the restoration. So it uh, it turned out pretty well. It's it's definitely not the nicest or the cleanest or the most original WD-45 out there. But it's mine and I like it and I'm happy and like I've said before, there's only one person that has to be happy. I got my mini alternator on there. These will run on one wire, but uh, since I already had my alternator light on here, I wired it up so the alternator light works. I like having an alternator light. It lets you know right away in case uh, you break a fan belt. But uh, the light there comes on. Still in neutral. I've got three things left to do on here. I want to uh, tidy these wires up. I want to get some uh, covering and cover those up. I've uh, I've got to paint the spokes and the hub on my steering wheel. I don't remember why I didn't paint those earlier. I had a reason, but I don't remember what that reason was. And I have to do my tail light. I, wanna, I have I have the original tail light for this. I want to get that painted and put back on there. But uh, the original tail light is about the size of a pine cone, so that's not going to be a big deal. So yeah, I'm pretty darn happy with it. Uh, I think it, it certainly turned out good enough for me. Uh, probably not going to have this hooked onto my grain drill. I I like using my H on the grain drill. Uh, <laughs> that's kind of the kind of the tractor that I have always used on the grain drill. I can guarantee that this will be on my 56 planter when the time comes. So uh, so yeah, we'll call this project done. Like I said, I've got those three little things to do on it, but uh, other than that, everything works as it should. So so we'll be seeing this thing working around the farm uh, as time goes by. So that's it for my WD-45 restoration project.